Remembering the abusive cycle I'd lost myself within, parting with my mother was vital to saving myself and our relationship. It was in foster care that I constructed a different definition of home. It wasn't continuous destruction and fear anymore, and it wasn't the responsibility of keeping my mother well. Instead, it was the reason I progressed from dreading each step that brought me closer to racing alongside all the other young people to get home. I was suddenly a priority. My day mattered, my thoughts and feelings mattered. I mattered. Foster carers opened their doors and shared their warmth to provide us with a second chance at creating meaningful relationships and flourishing within ourselves. One of my foster carers took me to the theatre for the first time in my life and another let me paint my room my favourite colour. I was taken to select a real Christmas tree for the first time and walked the dog I previously wish I always had. Simply eating a meal without feeling guilty about how much would be left for the rest of the week. Foster carers provided me with the experiences my mother couldn't and gave me the space to develop as an individual outside of trauma. There's definitely much to be appreciated and I hope that this is a reminder of why what they've chosen to do is so significant.